everybody, I am Liz and today I am here to talk about meeting authors and I've never really met like authors that I knew and followed before and so this was a very surreal experience. I had the privilege of meeting V.E.R. Victoria Schwab and also Kirsten White at the King's English in Salt Lake City where they do, it's kind of an indie bookshop where they do book signings and so I basically had Victoria Schwab sign all of the books I owned of hers. I bought three books at the signing so I have basically every single book series she's ever written except for the archived book series which I hope to get soon. And I've only ever read her book one, A Darker Shade of Magic. So I've only read one of her works, but I was really excited for The City of Ghosts. And now hearing her talk about Vengeful and Vicious, I am so stoked to read this series. And I just feel like this creative energy when talking to an author, I feel this intense need to read her works. While waiting in line for my books to get signed, I read 65 pages of The City of Ghosts, which is phenomenal. And I was revamped to read and continue on with the Darker Shade of Magic series and enjoy the thrill that everybody around me during the book signing was feeling. And I got really excited for the comic series, the prequel to A Darker Shade of Magic. And so I am so stoked and I think that's what I love so much about meeting authors is that you really feel this sense of passion and commitment to their works and so you want to read them even if you hadn't read them before or weren't super invested to continue on with some of their books. And then we have meeting Kristen White. It was October 1st, which couldn't have been more perfect for the release of a Frankenstein retelling. So this book was actually published September 25th for those in the US, but I got it and was able to have it signed on October the 1st which is just so atmospheric and so incredibly wonderful. Now, I haven't read any of Kristen White's books, not a single one of them. I was not ever invested in her stories until about six months ago when I found out that her series, And I Darken, is a Vlad the Impaler retelling. I had never known that this book series was a Vlad the Impaler retelling, and I was all, what the hell am I missing? Why did I not even know about this? I thought it was some generic fantasy historical novel. I did not see the implications, the crazy things involved in this story, and so I was like, oh, this is amazing. I need to know more about this author. I need to discover more about this author. And then I saw this book. It was being published. I was found out about it through Lindsay Cummings as I follow her on Instagram and she got this book in a kind of the thank you like arc or whatever edition of it and it looks amazing. I mean you can't tell whether this is cloth or skin. It is cloth, but it looks so amazing. The color scheme and the sewing and just the story of Frankenstein. I absolutely love the story and how it brought about women fame in writing. It brought about sci-fi as a genre. So it was such an amazing impact. And this story was released for the 200 year anniversary of Marie Shelley's book, Frankenstein, which is amazing to think about. I do have to say that meeting her was so hilarious, breath of fresh air. I was so freaking stoked to see her and meet her, even though I've never read a single book by her. 
but just the mere fact on who she is a person, how much she loves Halloween, how much she has her kids also love Halloween and decorations and like things that are spooky and scary and all the stories that she has come up with throughout her time as an author and everything like that was just, it just blew me away. She quickly in that one 45 minute session of her just talking and answering questions of people who are familiar with her works just really made me so excited to read her works and get to know her more and be really excited for some of the books that are coming next. And I just, I loved all of her stories and how she talks about her editor and her cover artists and how just much of a friendly, altogether good person she is. And so that is my main takeaway of meeting authors, is I've never really done it before. And I love it. it they are so nice. They are, have so much stories and creative outlets. And they really motivate you to read their works and really just read in general. And they're just, they're really nice, really great people. They have so much great, like, motivations and stories that got them to where they are today and it is just so great to meet people who you can look up to and so if you haven't met authors i strongly encourage you to do so if you have met some of your favorite authors please let me know in the comments down below because meeting them is just such an amazing miraculous experience I'd love to share with you if you've met Victoria Schwab or Kristen White please let me know so we can kind of see what types of different stories that they relayed while talking with you and all of that jazz I hope you enjoyed this video I know it was a very weird impromptu thing that I did because I was just so stoked to talk about my experiences meeting these two fantastic authors in the span of three days. So please talk to me in the comments down below if you like some of my impromptu videos or some of my more structured ones. Please follow me by subscribing, liking this video, and all of that stuff. And I am so excited to see you more throughout this lovely October month. I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.